up guys african traveler again and uh, i know you guys are surprised why, 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 why am i driving mombasa so i just hired a car uh, at about 2500 a day in mombasa so my daily charge is 2500 i want to be i'll be here for a very few days but uh, just to make it easier for me to move around without inconveniencing the uber driver or you know taking their time i I saw, I saw fit to take a to hire a car for three days it's actually easier it's 2,000 per day it's like $25 or $300 a day so I'm going to take you to a very exciting place you guys gonna love it so the Vipingo Ridge so one of the best real estate in the, in the coast of Kenya stop by to show you some of the sisal plantations around whoa African traveler here so this is how sisal plant plantations look like drone views of the area so uh, yeah but as you can see it's full of sisal plantations and i have a small hired car here <laughs> oh so there's this road i should have used a lot of development going on in this area lots and lots of development the drone shot you guys will love it. Nice plantation. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way. And guess you try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away. But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to gray. As you fade away, as you fade away, yeah, I'm about to fade away. Cause every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday. Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain. All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way. Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray. I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay? Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby have a taste All the highs and the lows, no you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you but I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side, maybe we could be okay Okay, okay, maybe you could be the change I need today, I promise that I've never felt this way I really hope that you friend promise promise yes. ah, so promise you are so promise is gonna be my guard around and uh, you're I'm, I'm a golf professional here. you're a go golf professional here yes, yeah. Ah. so yeah so promise is gonna take me around and we're gonna see a beautiful Vipingo Ridge it's about um, 
over eight kilometers. Over eight when kilometers. You do, when you do the whole eighteen. Okay. Oh, when you do the, the whole eighteen kilometers is the whole eighteen holes. Yeah. You end up covering about eight kilometers. Eight kilometers. Yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, the area is huge. You know, yeah. coming here, you know, I almost got lost inside the <laughs> the premises. The premises. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Now. Yeah. This is hole number one. Okay. So we have we have what we call these are starting point. We call them tea box. Oh, tea box. Yeah. This is where people are teeing off when they start playing golf. Yeah. And um, that's uh, black tea or blue. Mm -hmm. That's where most of professional would prefer playing because it makes the the hole longer. Mm -hmm. And then there is this white white marker uh -huh. that's for amateur or people with uh, handicaps so this this or this one no the, the, tea. the, the, tea. the, the tea oh, yeah, oh. Yeah. and then um, can okay. just continue and then we continue we have um we have the yellow mm. the yellow is from mostly people play here are senior golfers old people or mm -hmm. beginners or kids juniors so blue is pro white is a uh, amateur amateur the yellow one is uh it's for seniors for the seniors men men yeah why not ladies and ladies are far much ahead because you know ladies do not hit far so really we not? <laughs> give them advantage oh, I see. Yeah. in every golf course you'll find the tee box for ladies is always in front in uh, front yes oh. so this is the ladies tee box the red one the red one yeah okay yeah okay. proceed okay. yeah. yes oh well, from the air i can see this place is one of the most you know i've seen some of the best houses i've seen in the country okay yeah i just wanted to know if people want to buy land here yes. or do, do you guys build for them or they buy land and uh, they build for themselves yeah we are we have many options first yeah once you own a property here like a land yeah a half an acre one acre yeah we have uh the Pingo Ridge have recommended contractors and mm -hmm. architects Okay. and we have guidelines so once you own you buy a property from us yeah there is always somebody who can build for you not us oh you can find your own yeah you can find or you can come with your own contractor uh -huh. and then build like some people have done that they buy land and they build their own they build their own house at their own test okay and so how much is the value of land the value of land here is between 100 thousand US dollar. One hundred thousand US dollar? Up to yeah. two hundred yeah. up to two hundred and forty thousand US dollar. Now this one will depend with the location and the size of plot. If it is in a prime area it might be a half an acre going for maybe one hundred and eighty or two hundred and uh, two hundred and twenty thousand US dollars. And USD. Yeah. So USD is just like if you say a hundred thousand, is it ten thousand or hundred thousand? Hundred thousand. So that is like uh, ten, ten M ten, 10 million. million Kenya shillings. Ten million Kenya shilling. Yes. So for which size of land? That one it's like a half an acre. Oh, half an, half an acre. Half an acre. Ten million. Ten million. And yeah. you decide what kind of a house you build, but yeah. that it depends on the near the golf course. There's so many. Uh, yeah, it depends whether it's far from the golf course, mm -hmm. whether it has um, an ocean view. The oh, view. The view of the ocean. The ah. view of the ocean. Yeah. So. From so all, all all properties that are facing the golf course. Yeah. Are going f m for more than. 20 more than 220,000 US dollar 220,000 that's US about 22 million shillings 22 million shillings um, and any plot that has got a partial view of the ocean we have what we call deep plots they start from 10 12 16 million they have mm. different price and this is for per acre, half an acre that these are half an acre or a three quarter acre okay. yes 
and yeah, I'm sure you guys wanted to know that so if you didn't know now you know so it's one of the best place to invest it's about 30 35 kilometers from Mombasa yeah 45 kilometers from Mombasa 30 let's say 45 kilometers. 45 kilometers from Mombasa do you have people who like hit from the first to the to the hole into the hole that's yeah. what we call hole in one and it only happened in on a part three on part but three. you are you you have to be lucky okay <laughs> you have to hit a good shot yeah try and attack the flag uh -huh. then if you are lucky enough you'll get the hole in one wow. but it's very rare it's rare, yeah, it's rare. <laughs> but like pros like you know, tiger wood and uh, the rest those are the guys who've tried it not not even pros you see most of people who have got mm. who have had hole in one are amateurs not even pros. <laughs> really yeah really getting a hole in one is uh, <laughs> it's, it's a it's a fluke <laughs> It's not a flu. Yeah. If you hit a good shot, you you, you, get you it. must be lucky. <laughs> so and for you to be lucky, you have to hit a good mm -hmm. shot to the to the to the flat. This is a three bedroom and what you're saying is um, no let's just see the rooms first washroom. this is the washroom guys um, what's it gonna do okay. there's like a balcony here so oh, this is another room yeah Oh, see this, this is how the bedroom is. Huh? Yes. Mm. Oh, this is the four bedroom. It's got a small balcony. So what you say is like, uh, so per room is like 15,000. Yes. Oh, this is Kwanza Double. The bedroom is like 15k. Yeah. So if you want more bedrooms, the higher it is. Yes. In the balcony. Terrace. Yeah? This is the terrace. Oh, this is the terrace. And some terrace have a swimming pool, so unfortunately, this one didn't. And most of them are booked so we didn't have a lot of options to show you guys i love this coral oh this is coral today i'm going to meet uh, one of the director uh, of the properties and uh, mr salim haji salim haji yes. Oh, you're related to the one Haji? Uh, no. You're not related? Because <laughs> when I heard the name, I was a bit confused. No, no. Ah, so, so uh, we, my viewers would just like to know, you know, this is an amazing uh, investment, you know. I've gone around the golf course. Yeah. It's splendid. One of the best I've been to. 
Good. And I just wanted to know what was the uh, idea behind the real estate? Um, well, the idea behind the real estate is you've got to find a way to fund mm -hmm. the golf course and the other amenities. Okay. And really the only way to do that is through the sale of real estate. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, the idea came about, um, I guess, Great Rift Valley, because I, oh, yeah, yeah. I built the, that golf course also. Whoa. So Whoa. Uh, really it was just a follow up from there um, and deciding to if it could be done in a different location. Okay. I'm originally from the coast, so I knew about so, this. Oh, born in Kenya, I lived in Kenya all my life. So oh, you're actually born here and yes. bred. Yeah. And actually, Rift, Rift Valley, uh, is it Rift Valley Golf? Great Rift Valley. Great yes. Rift Valley is one of the best golf golf course in the world, in Africa as well. Um, yeah, it is a very nice golf course. It's mm -hmm. very different to this. It's very short. It's fun to play. This mm -hmm. is a full PGA length golf course. It's very different. So what is the PGA means for? Well. Uh, the, it, it basically refers to, number one, the PGA is an association mm -hmm. and we're the only golf course and academy that has an affiliation with the PGA in Africa PGA. at the current time. So PGA basically is a professional? It's a standard of, uh, well, all professional golfers should mm -hmm. be members of a PGA. Oh, okay. The original PGA is the one that's based in the UK, yeah. and that is called the Professional Golf Association. Association. Yeah. So this is the only one in Africa? It's the only one in affiliated. Africa that is affiliated to the PGA, yes, Amazing. at the moment. Amazing. I know they are looking to mm -hmm. develop, yeah. um, to raise the standard of professionalism in Africa, yeah. and, and so we hope we can lead that. Okay, so uh, how many events do you host like in a year? Uh, not that many. <laughs> not that many. <laughs> no, very few. Um, okay. We're very orientated towards our members yeah. and our homeowners. So it's not always in their interest to have yeah. a lot of big corporate golf. Uh, um, because, but I mean, that doesn't mean that we're not averse to it. Yeah. Um, but it's, uh, Vipingo is only really just opening up. It's always been considered a bit out of the way. So yeah. it wouldn't be a particularly attractive location for some sponsors. Okay. If they're appealing to the mass market, mm -hmm. um, it's not a good location. There are better locations for them, like Niali and Mombasa. Okay. Um, but we do appeal to the higher end market. The niche? Yeah, a niche market where numbers are small, they want to really look after their clients well. So it's actually uh, like a members, mostly it's a members club. Uh. Well, it is not. A, it is a members club yeah. in that the only way to be a member is to own a property. Okay, interesting. So you to be a member, you have to you own, have a to own a property yes. around the area. Well, you have to own a property within the Pingo Ridge. Pingo Ridge. Yeah. And do you still have some properties to lease or to sell? Yes, we do. Um, mm -hmm. We have some left on phase one, yeah. which have uh, just gone out on an offer. Yeah. Um, and we have phase two, which is about 600 acres still to develop. So the total land mass is around The total much? land mass of the Pinga Ridge is 1,100 acres. 1,100 acres? Yeah. Wow, so it's quite huge. Yeah. Uh, and uh, so it's only, as you say, phase two, that, uh, phase one and two? Yeah, phase one and two. We made, I mean, we may phase phase two into several phases, yes. but we've always talked about phase one and phase two. If, if someone wants to invest around, yeah. Uh, how much is the, let's say, uh, the, the, pr the price of the property around? Um, if you want to buy in phase one, mm -hmm. an acre, we're, they're going for between 35 million and 50 million mm -hmm. for properties. For an acre? Well, some of them are bigger than an acre, so yeah. the price range depends on the acreage of the plot. Um, in our current phase two, yeah. which we have, which are called the D plots, yeah. and they're on the, the, the road that you came in, they're yeah. on the left as you came up the hill. Yeah. So those we're selling at, uh, I'm not 100% sure, but I think they're around 15 million to 17 million. And they're smaller though, they're half acre, three quarter acre. Oh, from the range basically between yes, half and yeah. three quarter acre. And then as we develop phase two into mm -hmm. other developments, yeah. um, we're talking to um, professional master planners and mm -hmm. developers as to how we can best, you know, um, maximize the returns on, on that investment yeah. and in keeping with what we've already developed. Okay, so so, so uh, I hope my guys will come and invest in your property. Yeah, so I mean, how, they, should uh, they should, con I mean, if they have an interest, they, they should really definitely uh, contact the, the sales team. The sales team. Yeah, yeah, and book an appointment and they'll be shown around and with whatever 
options we have. Exactly. So basically, I will leave a, a link for the marketing team. Yes. Yeah. So they'll it will be. Well, easy it for actually them. will be the sales team. The sales team. Yeah. And the there is team. a. I think on the website there is a particular page about the sales mm -hmm. and how to contact them, and so okay. they can always go to our website. So basically, you buy land and you build according to your design. Yes, within very strict regulations. <laughs> <laughs> You heard that, guys. But uh, uh, yeah, it's 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 one of the amazing places to be in Africa, and I've yeah, come no, here. No. It's very serene, very yeah, no, it's very peaceful. beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Did you see some of the wild animals too, or not? No, I was told actually by promise that we have some wildlife in it, yeah. but uh, unfortunately no, I couldn't. And yeah. we're developing that because mm -hmm. basically these wild animals are being taken from conflict areas, mm -hmm. and we're providing them a home. Oh, so the forest is under Vipingo Ridge, yes, it is. and you're keeping some of the endangered. Well, a lot of the animals. I mean, they just roam freely. You mm -hmm. even see them when you play. What golf. kind of an animal? Animals we uh, believe. We, we have oryx, we mm -hmm. have eland, we have uh, waterbuck, we have impala, mm -hmm. and we have coming. I think we have some grunts gazelle, zebra, and giraffe. Wow, well, I wish I so, had an opportunity to see. Yeah, and you do. It's not very common, <laughs> but you do see them playing see golf, and it's very nice. Interesting, interesting. So, so I just want to say okay. thank you. No problem. And yeah, thank you for giving me the opportunity to showcase That's your okay. amazing uh, property. Good. And see you. See yes, you next time. Yeah, hope your your viewers uh, they will make love an it. inquiry. They will. Good. They will All for right. sure. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate. Right. Asante no sana. So, guys, that's it from me. See you.